the channel. Uh, today we are working on a programming challenge 2 in chapter 10 in the book starting out with Java and this programming challenge is to create a, a class called test score custom uh, exception uh, class and um, in this class we would uh, modify the class that we created last uh, programming challenge and we have to create a a custom invalid um, invalid test score class that would handle if the test score is a negative uh, score uh, or the test score is greater than 100 so we will create the class the custom the custom exception class uh, this would inherit um, from the exception class and it will have uh, two constructors. The first one is a, is a constructor without um, an argument. It will say error test score is invalid. And the other uh, constructor would have a, an argument. We will say error test score is in valid score so that's uh, all we have to do for this uh, custom exception class and uh, we have to go back to the test uh, score custom class and this class, uh, basically, we have to modify the class that we created uh, in the last uh, programming challenge. And if you didn't remember that or you didn't watch the video, um, we have to create a, an array of test scores. We have to create that and we create a, a constructor for this class. The constructor would take um, an array of test scores. So we we'll say this uh, test score equal test score, and um, you will create a for loop uh, to go through the array. And uh, we will get to the score. And um, you will say if the score is a negative, it's less than zero, then we will throw the invalid uh, test score class that we created. Um, and um, we also have to check if the score is greater than 100 and we have to throw the same class and we have to pass the score to the constructor in the in the constructor we have to throw uh, uh, we have to throw the class that we created invalid test score and um, Basically, you have to copy this, the for loop, and um, you will create uh, a method called the get average. So instead of using this, you will just remove this, uh, create a total variable here, and you will just add to the total test score of i and we will return the total divided by test score that length to get the average of the test scores and then we will create another class called main to test um, the class a main method uh, we will create try and catch a statement we will catch the class that we created invalid test score e 
and we will get uh, get message if there is any error and we will create a test score custom class ts uh, new Uh, test score no score custom class and it will take in an array int array so we say new int um, and curly braces as 88 77 102 and uh, 55 and we will get to the average here TS get average so we run the program and see as you can see uh, the exception uh, caught the score with um, that has that has a 100 or, or greater greater than 100 uh, error test score 102 um, is invalid score so at least at least one exception is working how about if we change 102 to negative 1 would that also uh, be caught uh, error uh, test score uh, is invalid yes this is also um, this is also works here so I think that is what they wanted wanted us to uh, to create um, we had to uh, modify the previous uh, class uh, test score class and we had to create a, an invalid um, test score custom exception class and we caught um, the two exceptions that uh, that they that they said in this programming challenge um, thank you for watching and uh, if you guys liked uh, this video please uh, comment and like and if you want to see uh, similar videos uh, from this book uh, Please uh, subscribe and, uh, and I will see you next time.